Mm, we finish this uh, Shodashav part. Ha ha. We'll go over the. Ha. So one difference that I have made is I got that uh, document with all the questions that have been repeated. So mostly I have highlighted those in these documents. You can go over those. Siladla, I've also highlighted the Purayata. Adu, uh, there are there have been some repetitions there. So you can take a look at that. Sandhi, Shobha, do you want to start off? Hmm. Do you have a document of all questions, madam? Irik, mm, I will share it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put it in the group. Prasiddha. Indha vati baskar vela shankri madam bannangla. Ah, I think she did that and sent it once. So I Super. have one document. I'll send it. Mikka nandri. Yeah. Prasiddha asi prasiddho si. Visarga ha utvam guna ha purva rupam. Right. Shutva and Chatva. Iti plus Aha Ityaha Yen Sandhi. Saha plus Api Sopi Tadapi Visarga Sandhi Utvam Gunaha Pura Rupa. Okay. Shutva idam Shutvedam. Um, a plus guna sandhi. Okay. Uh, iti evam iti evam. Hmm. Uh, Etadapi yan sandhi. Yan sandhi. Okay. Next is samasa. uh, samasaha. Hmm. Mahancha asau rushishcha uh, karmadharaya uh, visheshana pura pada karmadhar. Okay. But what is the resultant word? Oh, maharshi. 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 No. Uh, ah. So uh, what happens is Mahan plus Rishihi, then you have uh, wait. It actually be Mahat, right? So it becomes Mahat there. Mm. So ma ma Mahan, you, uh, Rishihi, here it has to go back to its uh, uh, Pratipadikam. So you have Mahat plus Rishihi. Mahat becomes Maha plus Rishihi. Hmm? Now here, A plus R, the substitute here for A plus R is actually A, right? Guna. Hmm. And anything that replaces a R should be followed by R. Repa. Uh, Repa. Repa. So, Maharshihi. Hmm. So, it's a replacement for both the, the A also is removed, the R is also removed, instead of both of these, you have R coming in, so Maharshihi is the form. Okay. Hmm. Ah, next one. Hmm. Ah, sarvasya prachodakam, sarva prachodakam, shashti tat purusha. Hmm. Okay. Uh, svasya shaktihi, svashaktihi. Okay. Um, uh, vijasya Okay. Modi Tatra Devanam Ganaha means there were many, many Ganas. Yeah. Like uh, like all the uh, uh, hierarchy they have and like hmm. that. Ipo, there are 33 main uh, Devas and then each uh, uh, Deva has his own army uh, for him. So there are, uh, and Devanam Ganaha can also mean Siddha, Charana, uh, Gandharva, Apsaras. All of these are different, different ganas also. Gataha sandehaha eshamte, gata sandehaha. So here, if you see that, uh, ex uh, you asked me that question of Triti Artha Bahubrihi and Chadu Shashti, right? Mm. So here it is, even though it is Kta Pratyaya in the first compound, you mm. still have yeshamte because yesham sandehaha gataha. So if you think of 
forming it into a sentence then you will understand why certain places you have yena and why in certain places you have yesha yes yeah mm. hmm okay mm. so gata sandhi anapoda sthiti yes hmm. yeah yeah so apodha anapodha sthiti yena yena ha uh, iti vaktavyam mm. by whom yena vindhya parvatena uh, swasthiti anapodha asit hmm hmm and then there is also that uh, abhigamanam is there so mm. like rame jeshta abhigamanam is is it jeshte or jeshtam prati adhik abhigamanam that kind of Je- jeshtam uh, prati uh, abhigamanam neva hmm. sarvatra jeshte abhigamanam jeshta abhigamanam iti that is also right Je- uh, the approaching the uh, elder person right so hmm. it could be abhigamanam jeshtasya abhigamanam iti i don't think it would be correct usually the so, destination will be in vitya also and so, so, shurpanaka went to rama and then to lakshmana jeshta abhigamana uh, lakshmana tam tam nirakritavan nirakritavan iti ha do you remember which shloka that is 35 पूर्व Okay, Jeshta Abhigamanath. I'll check that and tell you. Hmm? Okay. Uh-huh. There is another book that I will look at that and then let you know. Yeah. Here, so, the Gataha is actually here, it's Kartrikta. Right? Haan, so, Sandehaha Gataha. Iti. Gataha. It's not Karmani. Yeah, mm. so that's the difference. Yeah. yeah, so wherever there is a Kta Pratiya, which is in Karmani Prayoga, you have, you'll have Yena Saha. Pratiya. 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 Mm. Mm. uh dhatu rupani these are uh, there are three like four ways of expressing this uh, um bhutakalam so you have sma with vartamanam so you can say prati varsati sma prichhati sma if you add sma to it then it is past tense aprichhat is langlakara paprich is uh, 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 lit lakara ha and aprakshit would be lung lakara okay in general nowadays when you write uh, unless you are using lit lakara lit lakara is generally for the past tense which happened long time back you don't say um saha hya uh, evam papracha iti na saha aprichat hya you can use lung for uh, a lot of things aprakshit is a common uh, uh, bhutakalam that you can use for everything lung lakara is the normal uh uh bhutakalam that you use for everything whereas papracha lit lakara is for long past which is paroksham aprichat lang is anadyatane that which has not happened today if it had happened yesterday then you can use lang lakara i cannot say aham pratah kale um, udatishtham iti i woke up in the morning i stood up in the morning something like that you can't say for uh, uh, happening that happened today so anadyatane lang this is the rule that is given in the panini's ashtadhyayi uh, uh, among the sutras but then this is not being followed uh, in general we use lang because that is easiest to form immediately after latlakara when you know latlakara it is very easy to substitute uh, and uh, find out the langlakara because prichati is aprichat whereas if i have to search for lunglakara it becomes a little more tedious and difficult so we tend to use langlakara or sma for all types of past tense of course when you uh, with if you have a, a strong influence of sanskrit bharati then you will use ktavan ktavatu uh, prateya and kta prateya like gatavan gataha ityadika that's also fine okay that's one thing aha is actually vartamana kalam it is not uh, bhuta kalam should be here please repeat the uh, lunglakara point 
Lunglakara what is, is the one. Huh? No, no, Lunglakara for uh, Prichati. What is that? Aprakshit. Aprakshita. Okay. Mm. And uh, the up. Uh, what and uh, the Bahuachanam will be? Uh, Aprakshit. Uh, nalla question. Uh, சொல்லுங்க <laughs> 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 If I don't have to worry about Anadhyatana and all these complications, I simply can use Lung, is it? Yes. Lung is, uh, Lung is Samanya Bhutakala. You can Samanya use Chandradi for any Bhutakala. Um, Why is it so unpopular then? Because, Because it is difficult. Not. It is a tough huh? uh, uh, form to understand, uh, to bring, uh, to write. It is not intuitive, let me put it that way. it's got a lot of variations unlike lung so uh-huh. even though it simple the rule is that samanya bhute lung but uh, but the forms are so varied that's why people don't prefer it okay and uh, so you typically you can you stick with uh, aprichat and simply assume that it is also for yesterday yes it is also for today morning yeah, yeah today i understand but i'm just saying uh, for not today காமன் பவிஷ்யதம்திங் இஸ் அ ஃபியூச்சர் நாட் டுடே அனத்தியதனே பவிஷ்யத் and what i'm asking for is as follows okay. right i'm wondering uh, uh, these rules are all very strictly followed in all the texts madam or no. uh, not mm. kavyam yes oralavuk in kavyas they have sort of followed because kavya is uh, something that uh, <clears throat> someone is writing about something that happened long time back or it didn't happen it is in his imagination so it's okay to use any lakara in kavyas okay got it thanks uh, <laughs> but in the madri po texts la la patha they enga thidirnu kalambitar yeah so in the madri texts la patha you you use it uh, uh, either way so it doesn't matter uh, these are in karmani prayoga there are they've just grouped all the words that you find the verb forms and put it in different uh, uh, tabular columns so you can uh, check that out uh, okay